Okay. All right. Hello. Um. Ugh. Oh, this sucks. <laughs> oh, dude, wait, wait until I don't even. I don't even know what I'm gonna name this video. I seriously don't. Like, I don't even know. Just like big idiot loser, or I don't know. I don't even know. Day 100. And, I don't even know what day it is. 147 days, I think. Or no, 148, 148, I don't know, I don't know, whatever, it doesn't, that doesn't matter. Yes, I am still clean off of, I, I still have not used any opiate, no opiates, not, nothing, no, nothing like that, nothing like that, but I have freaking, oh man, I really screwed up uh, big time. So yesterday, I looked at pornography again. So, and I, you know, I, I don't know how long I hadn't freaking looked at porn. Seriously, before I did the first time, you know what I mean? Um, like a month ago or within a month, I, I freaking, I know I did it. And then yesterday I did it again. And, oh, dude, I, you guys like, like that is, ser that's seriously like freaking, that's a big, that's all, that's obviously a very big problem for me. Um, it's not right. And I know it's not right. And I did it. I knew it wasn't freaking right. And I did it. You know, I'm sorry if this video is just like confession because there, oh no, there's more, there's more. Uh, but this, I just have to freaking do this. I have to, cause this is hypocrisy, dude. If I don't, if I don't freaking confess this stuff right away and, and you know what I mean? Like, you know, I mean, uh, this sucks, dude. Um, but yeah, so I, I, yeah, I looked at porn yesterday, whatever. Uh, but no, it's like freaking, oh, it's like a deep rooted issue with me. Absolutely. Which I know that my wife knows that, you know, I have, I've got past stuff, you know, when I was a kid and whatever. Um, and there's reasons that it's been so hard for me to shake. It is, I'll go, dude, I'll go a freaking, you know, I'll go, I'll go a couple years or something without it and then all of a sudden it just freaking rehashes itself it's just or not I, I rehash it it's there's there's you know and it, and it always starts dude and this is true like I was really thinking about it last night and it's just so true like I find myself when I once I once I look at porn like now I'm all like oh gosh and I'm like can't just like not thinking about stuff and not looking at any women at all and da 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 and I'm you know on my best behavior but as time goes on, I find myself freaking looking and looking, looking and, and looking longer. And then like, then I'm like, Oh, you know, someone with blonde hair or, you know I mean? It's just like, you know how it is when you're a guy, like, it's just like, I mean, it could be like way off in the distance. It could be someone that you would never normally think is attractive, but you just have to look I mean, you just, it's, it's just crazy. It's like, it, we're just these stupid freaking animals or something. And we're not freaking, we're not stupid animals. In fact, dude, if we we're stupid animals, porn wouldn't be wrong. You get what I'm saying? Like the fact that you even, if you even feel bad about doing it or the fact that you know that it's wrong, it's a, it's, it's not like that. Dude, if we were animals, if we we're just organisms out of nothing, who cares? Well, I'm, oh, I'm looking at, I mean, if you saw a cow looking at, oh, he's looking at pictures of other cows having sex. I don't know. That might be stupid, but, but, it, but I'm, my point is it's wrong. It, it is wrong. And we, we, we know it's freaking wrong, but it starts out where I am freaking looking. I'm looking, I'm not, I'm not trying to not look or, you know what I mean? Like, and then once that happens, dude, and I don't know, it just sucks, dude. I'm so freaking mad. I'm so mad at myself. Oh, <sighs> It just really freaking sucks, but that's what happened. And, but no, wait, but wait, there's more. So then, so I, I had that and I was feeling like crap and I've been freaking just depressed. You know, I have, I've been freaking depressed. You guys, it's been, that's been the hardest stuff right now. It's and it's been the depression and anxiety has been definitely it's worst, uh, right now than this whole process. And I don't know, maybe early on, I was just really, expecting stuff and dealing with stuff differently or whatever, but I don't know. The pause are really, they, they, they go on a while and you got to freaking know that. Um, but 
But anyway, and la- yesterday was just an interesting day at work. I freaking had to stay late, and then I had to go in early today, like stay later than later, like by hours, and then go in early today because we were having trouble with crap. It doesn't matter. And I was talking to someone very close to me about just about that when I got off work, and I was with them, and uh, and just saying, oh yeah, now I gotta go in or you know whatever. And they're like, well, here, do you want an Adderall? And I was like. And I kind of had like, I was like, oh, well, and I was kind of going back and forth and they're like, well, why don't you just take it? And I'm not, no, this is not an excuse. Not at all. Not at all. Not at all. I made the choice. I made the freaking choice. There was something deep down in me that was like, yeah, yeah, actually I do want an Adderall. And they're like, well, just take it. And then you can think about it. And I was like, okay, and that's so me. That's so me. I always, you guys, I always do crap. Like whenever I do something bad or not, whenever I do something bad, I'm, I'm, I've, I have a history of very impulsive behavior, but like, I like, I toy, even like with the pornography, dude, I was like on there, I'm like, Oh, and I was kind of, and then like, I was just like, Oh, I kind of saw something. And then I was like, Oh, and I'm like kind of towing the line, towing the line. And then all of a sudden it just like, <sighs> and so, so even when I went to bed last night, even though I had the Adderall, I thought, well, uh, know maybe I, I shouldn't take it and you know knew knew I shouldn't have taken it well I freaking took it this morning actually I didn't take the whole thing but I I I I, I took I took over half over half of a 30 milligram I just left like this little chunk I don't know see there yeah there you go it's like oh now I'm not as bad because I didn't take the whole thing well no I just didn't want to, I, yeah that, there was no, that's nothing in my heart I just didn't it's like I'll freaking be up all night which I probably still will um, but yeah, so this is me on Adderall. I freaking took Adderall today. So, um, which is stupid. So, so, uh, there you go. That's my freaking, uh, you know, uh, as far as like doing substances and stuff like that, there you go. There's my first freaking, my first slip right there. Um, and honestly though, like, here's the deal. And I'm just going to be honest with you. This is just like a confessional video with no freaking information. This is just for the people I need to, yeah, this isn't for just like, this is not advice. This is just what, this is just freaking, I don't know. This is just what I, what happened to me or what I did to myself, what I did. Um, but the, well, the point was that this is all freaking fragile. This is all fragile. You guys free. If you mess up, dude, freaking don't let it snowball out of control. I mean, seriously, don't let it snowball. If there's other things in your life that you're trying to cinch up and, and, and really and really not do anymore or whatever, and you slip up, don't freaking be like me. And then because I because there was something in my thinking where I was like, well, I already freaking looked at porn, so I may as well like whatever freaking Adderall tomorrow. Like it'll help me not be so tired and da 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 da. And you just justify crap in your mind, you know. And and yeah, I took it. And and yeah, sure, it made me. Uh, I haven't been tired. Whoopty freaking do. It's not very good. It sucked. It, it's given me more anxiety anyway, or, or I'm just, you know what I mean? Like, um, it, it's not, it's not right as well, but it, it's not that it wasn't even, it's not good. I'm glad it wasn't good though. If it was good, then, it, then, you know, I don't even want to, you know, rehash that crap. No, not, I was never really, I was addicted to it, but not, not just full on. I don't know if, if that makes sense or not. I was addicted to what it did because I could do other things with it, you know, but anyway, um, but, but I, but honestly, I like it, like that all thing is just stupid. That's stupid. And I feel guilty about that for sure. But it's not even, it's not even to me guys, it's not even on the same level as porn. And I know some of you guys, I know some of you guys are, are like, you know, cause you guys have talked to me and stuff, and I know it's a big freaking problem, I know it's a big, big problem with Christ, with, with people that are Christians, dude, uh, I know it's a big problem just all over the, you know, non every everyone, dude, it, it's a big freaking problem for a lot of guys, and, uh, you know, um, it really freaking is, and it sucks, and, and, uh, I, I would love to make videos some days, some day of actually freaking getting free from pornography. Uh, that'd be great. That'd actually be really freaking good. Well, tomorrow or today's day one. So there you go. Day one of pornography withdrawal. So, uh, I don't know, whatever, but, but I, I'm more, I'm more pissed off at myself for doing porn because I know you open that gate to Satan, dude, you open up and it freaking can snowball out of control. And then, you know, uh, but anyway, 
Oh, uh, I don't know. Anyway, but but the point is, is this is so fragile, and dude, we gotta be careful. I gotta be freaking careful, you know, um, big time. I I will say I did not crave, um, I didn't I didn't crave opium at all, you know, e even through through this, and I just I thank God for that. Like seriously, that I didn't crave it or anything, you know. I haven't craved it at all through this whole process. Um, which is, uh, crazy. It's diff. it's different. And, uh, which I thank God for that. I, you know, I, I don't know. It just sucks. You know, I, 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 I'm in, I'm in the word and I, and I pray to God for deliverance and that'll help me hate it and, and not like it. And, um, but there's just something deep down at times where it just freaking, I, I, I guess I, I do. Well, obviously I still do like porn or something. I mean, like, it freaking sucks, you know, it freaking sucks, and, uh, sometimes it, you know, it casts doubt on my faith, even, it does sometimes, and it did a little bit yesterday, because I thought, I don't know, I just thought, like, what in the heck else am I supposed to do, you know, I don't know, and, and I don't mean that to, I don't know, I guess that's getting a little too personal, but it's just like, I don't know. I don't know how else to pray. I don't know how, I mean, I mean, I can't read like five hours of Bible every night and go to church. I mean, like, I, I don't know what else to do, you know, with that and why it re reoccurs or if that's just part of my life. But, but I, I don't, I'm not giving in. I was telling a guy a little bit there. See, that's the thing. There's still something in the back of my mind that like, I know, I know for a fact though, like this sounds weird, but it's just the truth. I know God will deliver me from porn. I know he will. I really freaking do. I know he will. Nor normally if this would have happened, yeah, I guess normally if this would have happened, it wouldn't have just been one time. It wouldn't have been one day or something. I would have freaking gone on, I mean, a, a week at least. I mean, it would have been a month and then I would have, or, or it would have been like all summer or, you know, through Christmas and then I'm going to repay and or, you know what I mean? Like, I guess in that way I'm, I'm make, making ground. I don't, I don't even know. I don't even know. I, I really don't know. Um, I don't know. This is just becoming a freaking uh, counseling session, I guess, but that's just, that's what I did. I, I just have to be honest with you guys. So I freaking use, I used Adderall. I freaking looked at porn again. So, and it sucks and I feel like crap and it sucks, but whatever it is. I can't, I can't change it. So anyway, Oh, I'm going to go, well, I'm going to go run and I'm probably going to run a lot and well, <laughs> for a few reasons, uh, cause the Adderall, the Adderall will give me, and I'll just be able to run. That's just, that's just what it is. That's what it does. So, but, but I just, you know, I just got to think and pray and stuff too. And, uh, go on a good run. I didn't run yesterday. I was so tired. I was so tired. Um, but anyway, can't get freaking bored, dude. Can't get freaking bored. All right. Don't get bored because uh, it sucks when you get bored. And yeah, anyway. Uh, oh, okay. Uh, really quick, though. Sorry. On a lighter note, uh, yeah, whatever. This is so freaking random, but whatever. Whatever. On the daddy day this week with my daughter, we were out picking out a birthday card for my wife. And I told, told, you know, my daughter, like, oh, you can pick out the card, at, and we're all, we're in Walgreens, and I, like, leaned back, and, it, and I, like, felt the pole, like, the pole in the store, you know, and I, like, leaned back a little further, and I, like, bumped, like, this whole display of freaking candy, the whole, the whole freaking thing went down, and I mean, it was, like, I'm, like, trying to pick it up, and, like, it was like folded out of cardboard too. Yeah. I mean, it was like so chintzy, but it was like, there's no bringing it back. Like dude, once it went, I mean like this thing was like busted freaking candy went everywhere. It was so freaking embarrassing. But anyway, that's on a lighter note, I guess. I don't know. I don't even know. I don't even know why I said that. I just, but it's true. So all of it's true. So anyway, Oh, I don't know what the heck I'm going to call this video. I really don't. But, dude, it's freaking fragile, you guys. Just, uh, and if you did screw up, if you did screw up, you know, whether it be uh, opium, you know, drinking, you know, if it's smoking crack, I don't even freaking know. Whatever you're freaking, whatever you know in your heart that you shouldn't be doing that you're struggling with, okay? Just 
and I got to, I'm telling myself this, you guys, like, don't, don't, don't go deeper and deeper and deeper down. Don't freaking give up. Don't, don't stop fighting. You know, um, you know, sometimes we just mess up a lot, like over and freaking, freaking over and over and again. And it really sucks, but don't give up. Never give up. Never give in. Okay. I talked to so many people on here that have tried getting off freaking opium a million times and they fail, but they just don't give up. They just like keep coming at it. I just met someone uh, yesterday, I think actually, or the day before, I think yesterday they were on methadone for like 15 years and then got clean cold Turkey. And I, I don't know how long they were clean. I think they were clean for a while. Uh, and then they relapsed and then they got on Suboxone and now they're getting off Suboxone and now they're like, you know, I don't know, probably two weeks off Suboxone or something now. And so, but, but, but anyway, just don't give up, don't give in, don't let Satan keep bringing you down. And, you know, and I'm, and I, I'm sorry for my hypocrisy. Uh, I apologize to all you, all you folks, seriously. Um, I, I know better and, uh, I need your guys' prayers. I really do in, in that stuff. Well, and all, and all this stuff, but, but seriously, I really need your prayers on that front. So this was just like a weird video. I don't even know. So anyway, I just want to be truthful to you guys. So anyway, all right, God bless everyone. Stay clean. And if you messed up, just freaking get right back on track. Okay. Right back on track as quick as we freaking can right back on track. Okay. God bless everyone and salute.